What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back to some more Grounded. So today, uh, we're going to shift gears a little bit. I want to do a little bit of base building here. And the reason I want to do that, that is because we, um, we unlocked our oven, which means that we unlocked our mushroom bricks. And we have a lot of mushroom bricks. So... Um, yeah, as you can see, we have we have a few mushroom bricks. So I wanted to build some of the stuff, uh, like the 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 castle-y stuff. You know what I mean? And oh, we got a spider over there. Um, I want to build some of the like the the brick stuff because I really haven't really like built a whole lot of it, and I feel like it would make our base look a little neater, a little cool. Um, so like originally our base was you know modeled after that um, that thing that we got, but I feel like we can make it a little snazzier, a little bit nicer. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead. We're gonna play with some. We're gonna play with some base designs here. See if we can't come up with something um, a little bit more castle tastic and uh, go from there. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. So without further ado, let's go ahead and let's start with these because this is kind of what I wanted to start with here. Now. Um, I would love to actually, you know what we might curved half floor unsupported. We might be able to do something with these as well. Because like, I kind of want to curve there, curve there, there and there, you know, I kind of want like a tower thing. Is that actually a big enough tower though? I don't feel like it's a big enough tower. I feel like it needs to be like from here. You know what though? I don't think we have an option. I think that's like the 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 radius that we have to work with. Okay, you know what? Actually, we need to test something here too. Can we place so if I place that there and we build this, can I place a ladder on that? So if we wanted to crawl up the um up the towers, like is that even a thing that we can do? I mean, we kind of can. It looks like we could probably put it right here. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, um, we could also do a stairwell up it. Okay, so that gives me, okay. All right, some ideas here. Some ideas, we got some ideas. So, uh, let me go ahead and take a, we're gonna step back. I'm gonna take a look and I'll, uh, I'll we'll, we'll get something figured out here. All right, so another thing I think we need, I think we need to make sure that we actually have all the base pieces unlocked. <laughs> Cause I, I actually, I don't know if I have the regular curved foundations unlocked for like uh, the grass stuff. So we're gonna try to see if see if that's a thing. Curved bases. There we go. Okay, so we need that. Um, and then let's see. Do we need anything else here? Feather roofs. I don't think I'm gonna do anything with feather stuff. Um, the turrets would be kind of cool. So we'll go ahead and get the turrets as well because like I feel like we're gonna need to set up some defenses. And I think everything else is good enough. And now we don't have like hardly any uh, any science anymore. <laughs> Okay, so I got my uh, I got my foundations here. Now I want to go ahead and place the first little bit of the stone curved stuff. Uh, let's see. Let's change the material here. Let's do curved wall. So I want to do that, that, and then I want to get the uh, little window wall here. Now, how is that gonna look? Let's let's go ahead and take a peek here. How does that actually look from out here? Okay, I think it'll be fine. So what I need to do is I need to make sure that I'm spacing these equally apart. So that way we can have like our main entrance here. I might actually do an actual entrance too. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, we're gonna fight this guy real quick. Um, I'm gonna see if I can fight him without using a gas mask. I think we can take him out without a gas mask. <laughs> we got him we got him but we did die so but like that's okay because my base is right here but we got him without a gas mask <laughs> oh that's funny oh no oh i'll be back okay so we made it back so <laughs> i forgot i may have been in the middle of recording a uh, another episode <laughs> So my spawn location was different, uh, but that's okay. We're back. We're good. We're good. We're doing the base building stuff. Okay, so this looks good. Um, I'm going to go ahead. Let's see. One, two, one, two. So like the other castle thing should be right here. So it's going to go up through right here, which I think will work just fine. Unless I'm thinking maybe we should extend this back a little bit and have the, I don't know. Let me, let me see. Let me see what we got. Okay, so that's kind of the front. That looks that looks pretty decent. It doesn't look too bad. Um, 
I like what we got going on here. So basically what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to do like a, a facade. We're going to work on the exterior part and make, you know, kind of build it up. The interior part will probably slowly redo over time. Um, but that's going to be like the outside and the core area. Now I would like to build out a little bit this way and have like a kind of like a courtyard here, maybe build a better entrance and stuff like that, put the turrets up and stuff. So, uh, we will see, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> but first let's get, let's get the, uh, let's get the rough design done. I'm gonna have to cut down some of these things and I'm actually kind of curious to see how these are going to work with, um, well, there's going to be stuff in the way here. So this is going to be interesting. Okay, so I got the floor extended out. Um, as you can see, we're gonna have a little bit more room here to play with stuff. It's gonna be super nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these walls built. Now we are gonna do something with the outside and like the underneath, um, it just to make it look like it's not like completely floating in air because it is completely floating in air kind of. Um, and just to kind of like reinforce some things. Oh, I need to get rid of some stuff out of my inventory. It's fine, we got plenty of room. So we've got these walls to finish up here. And then let's see, I'm gonna have to do some moving of stuff, which is okay because um, what I think is gonna happen is eventually these walls are gonna come down. I'm gonna put some pillars to hold the floor up, uh, but these walls are gonna end up coming down and then that's gonna give us this whole bottom area to work with stuff and have more room for stuff. So I think it'll be good. I think it's gonna be a nice change. Okay, so the, the first layer of wall is done. Can we still get, we can still get through here. So that will still work these line up. That's fantastic. Let's see how this looks from the outside over here. Yeah, see, look at that. It looks like we actually have some kind of a, a castle thing going on here. I like that. That looks so much, that actually looks so much nicer than, than just the grass. <laughs> uh, we'll have to do something with the floor for sure. Uh, definitely with, I think we're going to end up using like weed things or something like that. You know, maybe making angles coming in so it looks like it's supported. But uh, yeah, I like that. I like what we got going on here. Okay, perfect. So that works now. The, th the next thing, the ex next order of business is that I need to make sure that this upper floor is held in place. So we have pillars um, and I wanted to take a look at those pillars because I've actually never used the pillar. Oh, look at this mushroom door. That's super cool. <gasps> oh, there's a mushroom curve door. Oh, I like that. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Where's our pillars? Okay. Now, can I put these, uh, location obstructed? Is that because there's something in the way or is it? Okay. So like, I want them right here like that. Cause then I think I can take these walls down. And I don't think everything will collapse. I think that will be structurally supporting. Uh, we're gonna move this. I gotta, I gotta, move, I'm gonna have to move some things here in order to get these all in place. But I think, I'm not gonna lie, I'm really scared to take these walls down because I don't want, like, if I take these walls down and everything collapses, that tower that took me forever to, is gone. Like, it's gone and it's super sketchy. Oh, man. Oh, and then the stairs are gonna be in the way. You know what? I'm thinking we're gonna throw the stairs in one of these towers. Uh, to get up to the next floor. So we'll probably end up throwing a stair in. Yeah, it'll go in one of these towers so we can get to that next floor. Oh, I'm so scared to take these out. You have no idea. I mean, it says supporting zero. So, I mean. And I really want to keep the staircase here for now. Let's do this. Supporting zero. Okay, nothing broke. Now, can I get, see, I really want this pillar in here. I'm so scared to take these walls down. You have no idea. <laughs> okay. So you know what? Like this is working here. However, just to be safe, just cause like, I'm still just, if I destroy everything, I'm just, it's, it's going to be. We're going to have to rebuild like everything on the base. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put these there. And I'm going to throw in some grass floors. Right there. And let's go ahead and do another one right here. Just in the event that one of those pillars doesn't work, these should uh, work as supports. And in theory, they should support like everything. 
um they should like we should be able to build off this wall and build this whole platform off of it and it should be fine so uh i'm just really hoping that the game registers that that is now like the supporting area and that oh this is scary okay all right i'm gonna go through and get rid of the walls this is terrifying Ooh, you know what i just realized though my chests that are hanging on these walls here uh let's go ahead and just move those don't want those to break okay the whole lower floors removed <laughs> or the lower walls are removed oh my gosh this is terrifying it looks like a disaster right now it's because it is it's because it is but that's all right we're gonna make it look pretty here soon all right there it is the walls are removed oh this feels so much more open now i love it so i think what we're gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and um, expand the floors out to this level here or maybe I'll leave these outside. I don't know. Maybe I'll expand the floors up there because we could. We could we could widen the floors up up here uh, to go all the way out here. We probably should, in all honesty, so that way we can like actually see out. Hmm. Okay, so I've got the all the walls too high, doubled up, um, and then I just need to get the floors expanded out on the top part for whatever we're gonna do here now i i'm thinking like i said i'm thinking about putting the stairs actually in here so i might actually have to get rid of this floor and kind of figure that out um and then remove those stairs but let's go see how everything's looking from the outside because the outside is what we're worried about right oh yeah it's looking very castle like looking very castle like indeed i like that now um this is using quite a bit of materials uh we had <laughs> we had almost a chest full of bricks and now we're down to like about here i mean i think this whole area right here was full of bricks so um you could see like i mean it, it you see it feels like you have a lot but then it, i mean i guess it does go pretty far i can't really complain too much so um, i want to get the floors finished here and then i would like to get these stairs adjusted as well and i'm thinking about leaving uh thinking about leaving this area as an outside open area maybe we can throw the um the drying racks out here and then the uh um the like the water collectors and stuff like that so i don't because i think those have to be outside to work so uh we might throw those out there but you know what actually let's go ahead and let's get a spiral staircase in here and let's see how this works really i cannot build in combat who's in combat with me really let well, me guess a mite get out of here All right, so spiral staircase. Um, you know what? Hold on. I want this. I want it to come out. Okay, so if I play it like that. I'm trying to figure out how I can have this to where it'll come out the direction that I want it to come out. But you know what? I don't think it's going to matter think okay so i figured out this uh this staircase thing here basically we put them in the exact same spot and then we just put a uh, a curved floor connecting them and then that'll uh, let us go to the uh the upper level there and we can always jump off early too so it's actually actually we could always jump up too so um yeah that worked out pretty good it worked out pretty good okay so now um, i need to get those floors finished and like i said i'd like to also probably get I feel like we should just get this whole area enclosed and that would give us a huge level to work on upstairs too. Okay, so I'm doing a little bit of organization here and killing in some things up and uh, yeah, I feel like we're going along nicely. So basically we've got our uh, main crafting area centered on this wall here because the crafting bench has like it has a certain radius uh for how far you can reach so basically I set it in the middle and I'm trying to set um, some of these. I actually probably need to move these closer um but actually well here let's do a test let's see if i need what is only in this chest and not in any other chest 
Um, let's say that there's uh, this, maybe this lily pad wax. I throw the lily pad wax in there. Can I see the lily pad wax? So the thing that needs it is probably the lantern. Slime lantern, lily pad wax. Oh, it shows two. Oh yeah, so yeah, we have two. And well, hold on. Okay, it shows that we have two. So if I grab this and I move it to this chest, there's no room, this chest. I know that's close enough. Okay, still only shows two, perfect. So uh, this actually is within range. So that's actually pretty cool. Good to know. So this is gonna be our crafting wall. I'm gonna throw up a whole bunch more chests in here because we need more anyways. Um, I made this little area our cooking area and actually we're gonna throw some chests up in here as well. Actually, hold on. I have this chest. Let's go ahead and relocate it. And the idea I think is to throw it kind of up in here, if that makes sense. So we'll just set it up in there. So then you're cooking, you can look up, you can grab the stuff out of the chest that you need. You can grab, you know, we can throw a chest like this. Um, and then that will hopefully keep everything in the area of cooking supplies. And then over here, we're gonna have like a refinement. So um, now these are not going to reach this storage over here because like there's that. Um, so what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to do something similar here. I've been putting, I've been trying to put up these shelves kind of like that and then throwing storage chests on top of there. So I think that's what we're going to do there. Um, kind of keep things off the floor if we can. I like having, I, for some reason, I like having the chest like up right, right above what you need. You know what I mean? I like that or having, you know, general storage in here. So this is all looking good. Um, I went ahead and I moved some things up here. So as you can see, we've got our uh, we've got our dew collectors. We've got a ton of jerky racks up here. So those are all looking good. Um, this wall is gonna stay like it is, I think. I think this wall is gonna stay like it is, and then we might do. Actually, you know what we might do is we might do an overhang over all of this, so that way it matches, um, and then kind of go from there. I don't know. We'll have to see. So uh, yeah, things are working, things are looking good. It's getting cleaned up. We have a lot more area now to mess with stuff, which I really like. Uh, and then as far as these general storage things go, I think what I'm gonna end up doing is, I mean, we're gonna either build a outdoor area right here for them. I think we're gonna build an outdoor area right here for them out the back. I don't wanna do anything too much off the front. Well, we built it off the front. We could put our stairs down. Of course, if we, the problem is like, if we attach stairs to our base, then all the bugs can get up to our base. Whereas right now they cannot. <laughs> so I don't know, we'll see. Leave a comment, let me know what you think. But we have our castle beginning. Look at that. I feel like it's nice. I feel like it's nice, I like it. I like the things, I like the stuff. I think, I think it looks pretty good. Now, I think this is all we're gonna do for the castle building for now. Because what I want to do is um, get the floors finished up and then kind of get an idea what I want to do for more castle pieces and get some more bricks made in the meantime, because I like being able to have the materials that I need to build it um, as I build it. Otherwise, it's like, you know, lots of blueprints chilling around and I don't really like that. So, uh, but yeah, there we have it. We've got we've got some things we need to clean up some things as well. And this um, this upper level right here, it's going to get a lot bigger. So I think what we're gonna do is I think we're gonna do some um, some display stuff in here. Uh, we might display like you know all the different ant heads. We might display all the different types of weapons and things like that. Um, have some kind of like display room, display area. Maybe we'll throw some. Maybe we'll throw some displays on the walls here too. I don't know. I I used um. I did use windows everywhere. I didn't use solid walls because I wanted to keep it as open as possible. So, um, but yeah, that is gonna end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. And hopefully I'll see you guys in the next episode. Now, the next episode should should be the ant lab. It should be the ant lab. So we'll uh, I guess we'll see how that goes. But it should be the black ant hill lab. Um, yeah, it's gonna make fun stuff. But yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.